Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So unfortunately, we have yet another issue where Microsoft is blocking the 24H2 update if you have USB devices that support ESCL scan protocol. Now, once again, this is an official known issue over on the known issues health dashboard page, and Microsoft has this to say. After installing Windows 11 version 24H2, you might experience issues discovering USB connected devices that support the ESCL scan protocol, and that's short for eScanner communication language. They carry on to say that you might observe that your device does not discover the USB connected peripheral and the device discovery does not complete. They mention that this issue primarily affects USB connected multifunction devices or standalone scanners that support scan functionality and the E ESCL protocol. Now that's quite a mouthful, but um, what you need to know about ESCL is basically it's a driverless scanning protocol that helps to find available device printers and scanners and so on via USB or wireless networks. And what's happening with this issue is that 24H2 is breaking its functioning and then the computer cannot find the devices that are connected using this protocol. And apparently many users who use Mopria printers at office and in a home environment environment are affected with this issue. Now at this stage, Microsoft says that it has no workaround for this problem and they are going to pause and stop the update being offered uh, to PCs with um, these um, so-called um, these relevant printer drivers. And as I posted earlier today, um, Microsoft had blocked the 24H2 update as well for some Ubisoft games that were affecting um, the installation of 24H2 because those games were crashing and freezing and causing issues. That video will be linked down below and in the end screen. So this is yet another problem now that Microsoft has to resolve with 24H2. And I'm starting to think why Microsoft even rolled out the update this year. I think they should have done a lot more testing and maybe rolled it out as a 25H1 update next year sometime or whatever. But this update is causing numerous issues for a lot of people. Now, as I mentioned in that previous video, if you are still running 23H2 and have this scanning protocol or maybe a Mopria printer, then there's a good chance you most probably will not be offered the 24H2 update through the Windows update page. And you must also avoid forcing the update. If you've not seen it through Windows update, you must avoid forcing it. Um, by maybe using the update assistant or media creation tool and so on from the download windows page because that can cause issues like i'm experiencing with some aspects of my os after forcing the installation for the purpose of this channel and uh, um, microsoft will be blocking it until your device meets the upgrade standards so those safeguard holds are blocked and once again microsoft has this to say they say that they are working on a resolution and will provide more information when it's available and obviously when I get that info, I'll let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.